Good morning, folks, and welcome to a Thursday morning edition, August 25th, 2022. Folks, each and every day, I pray and ask God to show me a verse, show me a verse that you want me to, to dwell on, to spend time with today, and of course, to share. And he brought to me Galatians chapter 2, verse 20. And uh, I thought I'd share that with you this morning. Galatians 2, 20 reads as follows. I have been crucified with Christ, and it is no longer who I who live, but Christ lives in me. And the life which I now live in the flesh, I live by faith in the Son of God who loved me and gave himself up for me. Jesus was crucified for us. Jesus was crucified for our sin. Okay. We deserved to be on that cross, not him. Christ was sinless. He did nothing wrong. Okay. But we did. Right. But in that way, in that way, we are crucified with him because he took our sin upon him right there on the cross. You know, there's nothing that we can do to be saved. Okay. As far as we can't give enough money, we can't be a nice person enough. We can't do nothing. Nothing can we do enough. It is by his grace and his mercy before the foundation of the world. You know, he said that he, I know my sheep. I know who my sheep are. Okay. We need to come to Christ. We're commanded to come. We need to repent. We need to believe that Jesus is who he is. Because through Jesus, we will have eternal life. There's no other way. There's nothing that we can do. There's not enough merit. It's not a merit-based system. It's through his grace and his, and his mercy. And we're justified through faith in Christ. Okay? Through faith in Christ. Nothing else. Not by works. Any of that stuff. Folks, if you have not called on the name of the Lord Jesus, I pray that you do so today because today is a day of salvation. Okay? It's today is a day of salvation. Don't wait till everything's right because you'll never get there. We're, we're not we're not right. <laughs> so uh, anyways, don't don't wait. Okay. Call on the name of the Lord Jesus. And if you ever, ever have any questions, please feel free to contact me by this email address right here. Let me know. We'll get together by video, phone call, whatever. And I'll be glad to open Bibles and, and we'll, we'll have a, a conversation, a discussion, discussion on this. All right. And with that being said, your prayer request, you know, um, I appreciate your prayer request. I, I take them seriously. You know, I, I, I pray each and time before I hit record, I pray for each and every one of y'all. And uh, it, it's a blessing to do that. It's a blessing to petition the Lord with uh, my my concerns, my prayers, and, and, your, and your prayers and concerns. So uh, just please uh, remember that. Well, folks, uh, please do me a favor. Please do me a favor. Have a great day today. Stay in the Word of God. We can never stay in the word of God enough. I certainly don't. And if we're honest with ourselves, we're, we're all in the same boat. We can never pray enough. We can never, never talk to the Lord enough. Just, I just wish you a great day with many blessings. All right. Y'all have a great day. And we'll see you tomorrow for Friday's edition of A Moment in the Word. God bless.